I'm Joni Roses, and make sure you follow Ray's Chaos on YouTube. <laughs> and welcome back, everybody. My name is Ray's Chaos. Welcome back to my channel. <sighs> it feels funny not saying that, trying to say that mouthful of crap that I only got right, I believe, one time. So, <sighs> I'm going to start out light coming back, but I do have a uh, special, I don't know if you'd call it a theme, but yeah, all the a lot of the Friday videos this month are going to be centered around a particular type of, um, a, 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 yeah, I can't talk, um, it's going to be a particular theme, okay, I'm just going to just gonna go all out I mean this first week I'm just taking it a little easy because I just finished 31 days of videos and that hmm that was so much more than I thought it'd be to be completely honest with you but we're gonna start right back in with the regular pops and we're just gonna start off with the Masters of the Universe Sorceress. Now, I used to watch this show. I mean, I've shown a couple of Masters of the Universe figures, um, but uh, when I was younger, when I was a kid, um, you know, my younger brother was into the into uh, He Man of the Masters of the Universe. Um, but I always remember watching the cartoon, and you know, obviously being little kids, you know, he he brought his toys, I brought mine to the, to the mix, and we ended up, uh, having weird Star, Star Wars versus the Master of the Universe Wars, or whatever you want to call it, um, and whatever other, whatever, uh, ran, whatever other random character we got, uh, <laughs> I had DC Superpowers, which is still my favorite toy line of all time, um, but, uh, but one figure that, they, that if they put one of these out for the original set, it was way after we had gotten out of that. Um, so to have the Sorceress is one of those characters that I never understood why we never got one, but um, I'm happy to have... I, I think they even released the bird that, that the Sorceress turns into. Um but they never had the actual sorceress action figure. I mean, maybe they did, and like I said, it'd be like well after the point where we weren't watching the show anymore. But uh, yeah, this is really exciting. This is a cool figure to get, and she is just gorgeous. She's got a stand. Obviously, she doesn't stand on her own. Oh, her legs are kind of warped. So, let's get her a look. Yeah, that is, that is, that is a really good looking figure, to be honest. The way, the design on the hat. What I love about uh, the Masters of the Universe, which really doesn't apply in this case, um, or at least as far as I know, was that... Uh, even looking at the back with all the different characters, these look exactly like the the action figures of old looked like. I mean, the uh, the outfits they wear, the weapons they have. Um, uh, I noticed some of the crazy details. Um, and I mean, the only the only thing missing from Triclops was the fact that his his uh, eyes didn't turn and. That would have been really cool, but Funko isn't there yet. So, yeah, Sorceress was always one of those characters. I mean, she was always in the car cartoon, like almost constantly, but it was one of those, I guess it was, especially at the time, um, female action figures did not sell well. So I think that's why we had Tila and Evelyn, and I believe Tila wore a little headdress that she never wore in the cartoon. So I don't know if she was supposed to double because, you know, I have no idea. 
But uh, I'm going to give you a close-up of this one and uh, let you get back to it. And I'm going to continue to rest up because I've got plans for the Friday videos. I look forward to seeing you back.